guys, my name is Jaina. Um, I'm starting a new vlog. I hope you'll all be um, supporting me um, because it's my first vlog. Um, it's going to have a load of different things. It's going to be having food blogging, uh, makeup, clothes maybe, um, destinations, although it's coronavirus right now. We can't go anywhere apart from the bedroom to the kitchen to the bathroom, to the garden. Um, nevertheless, um, I want to be doing a new vlog and I want to share it with everybody. And I've uh, I've just done a new recipe for a, uh, an Indian dessert, suji halva, and I hope you all like it. Thank you. So the ingredients that you need for this recipe is semolina you can have roasted or unroasted semolina one cup and you'll need three cups of water uh, you'll need sugar you can add that to your taste you can make it sweeter or you can make it less sweet it all depends on your own preference uh, you'll need cashew nuts just a handful of cashew nuts and what I've done is I've split it uh, through the middle as well uh, a handful of sultanas um, it's up to you again handful I've taken but you can take more or less um, about seven or eight pieces of um, cardamom as well uh, you can add more or less you can have it crushed or you can use the cardamom powder as well uh, and then lastly you'll need ghee as well so we'll be roasting the semolina in ghee we'll be frying off the cashew the sultanas and the cardamom in ghee as well and then we'll show you how it all amalgamates together so the ghee is now heated up and what I'm going to do is I'm going to throw in the cashew nuts first because that will take a little bit longer to um, fry in this ghee. So I've added the, I'm adding the cashew nuts now and let that get golden now brown. Now that it's golden brown I'm going to add in the sultanas and it's going to work really quickly because it's going to heat up the raisins really quickly and it's going to, we have to work quick basically otherwise the sultanas will burn. So now I'm adding in the semolina. So I'm going to add the cardamom in now and give it a good mix. Water now and then give it a good mix. It looks like this at the moment and put it on high heat. Don't worry um, how it looks at the moment. Um, once the water is absorbed by the semolina, it will thicken, okay? How it's thickening up nicely now but keep stirring don't stop stirring else it will get stuck underneath and then it will burn so keep stirring okay and it will get so look how thick it has gotten and also look how it's uh, coming away from the edges of the pot as well but keep mixing um, it needs at least another five minutes because it has to get a little bit more solidified um, so keep mixing that's the key and um, the semolina has to be really nice and soft and at this point you can actually taste it if it's sweet enough for you so our uh, sujika halva is ready it's a hot at the moment so let it cool down really really let it cool down and it's actually really nice when it's cold pop it in the fridge once it's cooled down and it's a really nice dessert to have hope you all enjoy mm -hmm. 